I'm in the flow wave tank. I'd like to introduce you to Matthew Ray, who's director of Edinburgh Designs, who are making the wave makers for this facility. Matthew, could you tell us a little bit about the wave makers? Yes, of course. This is a unique facility in that we have put got wave makers that go all 360 degrees round the tank. So in total we have 168 wave machines, identical wave machines like this, and they all they go all the way round. They act on the water in front and then there's a dry passageway which we can walk through to maintain and look after the machines. In the middle of the tank we've got a series of current generators which can generate current from any direction. We can either go from north to south or east to west or change dynamically as we progress through the experiment. We're now here in the base of this big circular tank. Now you can imagine that there's going to be a big floor which separates the top section from the lower section and the water can be brought, drawn from the lower section and introduced into the top section and it's moved by these massive great pumps here. There's 28 of these pumps in a circle all the way around the tank. Water's drawn by a huge propeller down through here and then it comes along through these veins at the end of the tank here and then up through another set of veins and introduced under the wave makers and back into the tank. And again, each of these is controlled independently by a computer and can be brought, any water can be brought from the north or the south or the east or the west or any combination of that. We're here with some of the wave makers which are going to go around the periphery of the tank. They're hinged with these big stainless steel hinges at the base and they've got a big yellow drive sector with a force transducer that measures the incoming wave so that the wave that comes in from the other waves makers on the other side gets absorbed when it reaches the ones on the opposite side. 